there's no easy way to talk about breast cancer. It's a topic women fear to discuss. But that's where the problem arises. What we fear becomes all powerful. The best way to face fear is to accept the problems and still fight it. Before I go on, a necessary disclaimer. Any health topic discussed on the podcast is purely for educational and awareness purpose. In case of a health problem, definitely consult your doctor. Now on to the podcast. The Health Wealth Bridge podcast is powered by Shushastho Healthcare. Breast Cancer Early Detection for Prevention One of my aunt-in-law, another aunt, a family friend were all diagnosed with breast cancer at different ages. The good news is they all fought it hard and still fighting. They are survivors. But the battle is hard. Early detection can reduce the morbidity and mortality. But women are always apprehensive about seeking help. Talking about it may not do much except spread awareness. But that is what will determine the people who read my post continue self-examination. That's easy to do and our best chance for fighting this cancer. October is a month full of prayers to our gods and goddesses. It's also a month when we spread awareness about breast cancer. What's important to remember is, number one, you must examine your entire breast. Don't forget the nipple and the areola. Remember to palpate underarm. Blood-tinged discharge should never be ignored. Any symptoms beyond two weeks, consult a general surgeon and oncosurgeon for a checkup. Breast cancer early detection is the key to successful treatment. Some breast cancer statistics which will make you sit up. World over, breast cancer is diagnosed in approximately 2.3 million women every year and it causes 6,85,000 deaths each year. With over 70% of all the new cases and 81% of all deaths observed in women more than 50 years of age. The global burden from breast cancer remains concentrated in this group. By 2040, the number of newly diagnosed breast cancers is projected to grow by over 40% to about 3 million cases every year. Similarly, deaths from breast cancer are set out to increase more than 50% from 6,85,000 in 2020 to 1 million in 2040. Those are the bad news. But the good news is you can prevent it. As per Globocan Survey 2020, 178361 new cases and 90,000 deaths were reported for breast cancer in India. These are approximate numbers, but the earlier projections for 2020 by Indian Cancer Registry were 2,5424 new cases in the year 2020. There are many countries in the world which have a higher incidence of breast cancer than India, but their mortality rate is much lower as the patient may be diagnosed and treated in an earlier stage. There are also genetics at play here. Risk factors of breast cancer can be divided into non-modifiable risk factors and modifiable breast cancer risk factors. The non-modifiable risk factors for breast cancer include being a female, increasing age, early menarche, late menopause, having first degree relatives with breast cancer. These are all non-modifiable risk factors. The modifiable risk factors are smoking, alcohol, obesity, long-term use of hormone replacement therapy or contraceptive pills, advanced age at first pregnancy. Prevention of breast cancer includes doing regular physical exercises, breastfeeding for at least a few months and avoiding the modifiable risk factors. The symptoms of breast cancer include, irrespective of the age, breast lump and breast pain. These are the two most common complaints for which females seek doctor's advice. Other common symptoms are change of breast shape, recent nipple retraction, 
nipple discharge, etc. About breast lump. Although nearly 80 to 85 percent of breast lumps are not malignant, all lumps must be investigated before a final diagnosis is made. The genetics of it. The genetic origin of the disease is also found in a small percentage of patients. Hence, the need for extra precautions in female relatives of breast cancer patients. The individual risk of developing breast cancer is affected by the number of family members affected with the disease. The age of the affected relative at the time of diagnosis all influences the risk. Management of breast cancer, important points to remember. Early diagnosis is the key to timely proper treatment for breast cancer. But unfortunately, in our country, we still see patients in advanced stages of the cancer. Regular monthly self-examination of the breast, yearly clinical examination of the breast by a doctor, screening mammography every 2-3 to three years after the age of 40 definitely helps in diagnosis of the cancer at an early age. Breast cancer stage increases once it spreads by lymphatic drainage to the draining lymph nodes in the armpit and other places, by blood to distant organs like livers, lungs, bones, etc. It can also increase in size with adherence to underlying muscles and overlying skin. The 5 year survival for breast cancer is nearly 95% if patient is diagnosed and treated in stage way. This drops down to around 25% if patient treatment starts in the advanced stages. Self-examination of breast is to be done every month around the same dates, preferably following the periods. For this, one should stand in front of a mirror with both hands raised near the ear and later by hands on waist pressing slightly. This is to compare the shape and size of both breasts first. Check the level of the nipples and note if there is any nipple discharge. Look for any extra bulge anywhere in the breast area. Compare the skin texture. See if there is any dimpling. Then by putting the arm in 90 degrees, one should examine the armpit for any swelling. Then lying down on the bed with a pillow underneath the shoulder, one should with the help of fingertip and pulp and the palm examine whole of both the breasts from outside to nipple areas in a circular fashion starting from collarbone above, lower ribs below, midline medially and anterior armpit folds laterally. Any difference between the two breasts or palpation of a lump warrants examination by an experienced doctor. A mammography, an ultrasonography of the breast, a core biopsy are all important in management of the breast cancer. Treatment of breast cancer includes surgery, new adjuvant chemotherapy and or adjuvant chemotherapy, hormone therapy depending on stage and nature of the disease. The options in Kolkata include the Tata Medical Center Kolkata Rajarhat, Apollo Glenagals Kolkata, premier medical colleges like Calcutta Medical College, NRS, SSKM and others. Most government hospitals in India provide treatment free of cost. This is important to know that males are also known to have breast cancer and one out of every hundred patients of breast cancer is a male. The treatment options are the same. This article was inspired by Indian Medical Association's newsletter and it is issued in public interest. The information is for awareness only. Please do consult your doctor for, for more information on breast cancer.